Okay, Hugh, I'm recording, baby. What speed is that? Is that at the lowest speed? That's uh, at... Uh, Are you cranking it all the way down to like 60 RPM? That's as low as she goes. 60 RPM? Right. Wait, let me get a picture of that moving at that speed because that's what he's kind of interested in. And that's in left hand. Left hand. Now we're going to go forward. So that's the other direction. Right. Okay. And now we're going to speed it up. Is there a high low switch? Yeah. I know you have a range. So now we're at like 560? Right. And then where's the high low switch at? Well, I do not know whether you have I think to. you need to turn it off before you do the switch. There you go, high speed range. So now we're gonna move it to high. Okay. So what happens is yeah. you, you gotta, you gotta get around. it into gear. So, so you I, definitely wouldn't want to do that in Roche station. No, you don't. You want to turn it on. Oh, now it's humming. Well, it's up here. So hold on a second. So it's up here at the high range, which is like what, 4,500? It's in the red right now, right? So we were in low range. Now we're in high range and you're cranking it down to 60 again? Huh. No, that should be about 535. So what's happening is I have it. So this is, that was in high. No, it's in high. And we had it in low, but the problem is, is that, uh, I don't think so. Oh, there's no problem. It works fine. Now this is a down feed that I didn't know we had. Oh, it's but an this automatic has a, down feed. This is definitely has a Can auto. you show that running? Do you know how to run it? No. Oh, okay. So I just said. Okay. So, uh, let's show the table movement. Okay, so you got the DRO and the cranks, obviously. Crank it left and right. Then it has an auto feed on the z-axis. Or x-axis. X-axis. And then um, that's the rapid switch. This, yeah, they all have the same little feature. Yeah, so the rapid. Okay, there we go. And neutral. And you can run it the other way. Okay. Get over here. Now show it going in uh, Y and Z would be great. That Z, that's the knee. The knee's manual. You got to crank the knee manually, right? Yep. You're cranking it all the way down. I right? believe all of these. I did this the other day. Have I, yeah, auto they have auto drives. They put can. On them. You can do that. I've sold them like that. Now I cranked it all the way down the other day, and I measured this. This was about 15 and a half inches between this and the top of the table when the knee's all the way down. I'm just saying that for the benefit of the video. I know that. And now you're now you're moving it into Y. And now, can you show that automatically without the, using the manual handle? There is no. You can move it in Y automatically, can you? No, you, you'd have to hang one of these oh, guys okay. on no, there. Okay, you're right, you're right, okay. Well, let me show the DRO working. And of course, the DRO works in X2 if we move X. Okay, let me, he wants to look at the waves. I told him the waves were in pretty good shape. Nobody's been in there. Yeah, it's got the covers or, okay. They could be replaced, but they're intact and been doing their job. Oh, no, they're, they're good waves. I think they're in good shape. I mean the covers. Right, oh yeah, the covers, you can always replace those. Okay, cool. Well, I think that's probably good enough. Okay.